Greetings and welcome back to Idle Heroes. Alright, so they have a new event going. I want to go into the campaign first. I want to, of course, uh, do a battle and then start moving on. As you can see, I did move up to 10-5. Uh, 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 I made those little steps because it does take an eight minutes now between battles. So, and I'm actually level 99 now, so I'm sure I'll get some kind of cool thing, 100. The one I really want to do is the loot thing, because we're getting some new things here. Alright, you might notice the little jack-o'-lantern here, you know, in the middle there, in the bottom row. You might also notice the little bell next to it. Oh, there's also pieces of artifacts. We're going we're gonna to look at that. But that's really what I want to look at. This is the event, and it's actually kind of cool. So, let's just do that first. But then we're going to go in and we we'll do a fight here. Because like I said, it takes eight minutes to move to the next one. And you might notice there is a new individual in the group. Yes. I put the, uh, I put Vesta in there. And uh, so far she's doing pretty good. So let's just uh, do a, I, I took the, uh, the, uh, the female mage out. She knows she's down there below. Um, it's just that the other one is a really good healer. And also does pretty good damage too. So, I mean, the idea is, who would I take out? See, I can't take Aiden out because he kind of silences the uh, warriors, right? I can't take the Metal Mage out because obviously he's, he's 140. He's one of my six stars. But he also silences priests. So neither one of them can really go. Okay, the Assassin, you know, Bad Blood there, he's, he does good damage and also... He heals himself every time he got killed. And, of course, the two tanks up front. You know, my biggest damage dealer now is the um, uh, the dragon guy. He's the big one. All right, let's just go in and do a fight. Oh, look at that. We have a bigger guy. Well, dude, you're... Okay, wow. Just. Oh, that's right. This was a mini-boss fight, wasn't it? That means I'm going to get... I'm going to get some of those, right. Oh, I wanted to look at the damage. I am sorry about that. All right, we're going to start moving over. We're going to start moving over. What I'm probably going to do is go back to 10-5, though, afterwards. But you can see it's an eight-minute wait. All right, let's talk about those little jack-o'-lanterns and those little bells. First of all, oh, hold on a second. Because I, I, I went and got stuff again. Um, where is my bag? All right, let's look at the inventory here. Nope, nope, not that one. This one. Okay, you can see I have 39 of the little bells. And I have 18 of the little jack-o'-lanterns, right? Now, this is what we have here. Now, they're doing this stuff here. They're also giving us prophecy orbs, right? They're giving us one a day. Now, if we get 10 of these, and it's a long event. So, I already got two of them. I'm going to get another one in a little while. By a little while, I mean about a half an hour. Um, if you get 10 of them, you get these, and you get little 20 of the little bells. You get 20, and then you get... Basically a five-star. Yeah, I think that's chaos. I don't remember what that is. Uh, but it's the little red swirly one, you know. But it's a five-star. Actually, that's useful because if I ever want to do the dwarf, I need more of them. I might actually use the prophecy orbs in there too. So anyway, they'll give me uh, 40 of the little bells and stuff like that. So this is, this is typical. We've seen this before. Now the part we're looking at here is, notice down below here, we have item exchange event. You have the little bells and then you have the little jack-o'-lanterns. Look at the bells first. Now, the way I read this is that if I get 100, and I have 39 right now, this is just, well, that's a cool avatar if you want to do that, right? Okay, 100 gets me 10 prophecy orbs. But you know what? That's not what I'm looking at. The way I read this is that if I get 100, I can get this. I'm just looking and picturing that on my dude in the front and going wow or I can put that on the metal mage you know, one way or another that's like wow that's like wow and of course down there you got some artifact pieces down there that actually gets you one um, I wouldn't mind that though but I mean I have 39 of them and this has got a long way to go now let's talk about jack-o'-lanterns okay so 10 of I have 18 I could get five prophecy orbs right now that's right. I can get five prophecy orbs. Right. Okay, if I get to 20, which is only two away, I get those little guys there. Now, you might notice a little fella pe peeking in at the bottom there. 30 gets you another one of him. 
Yeah, just soak that in. I have 18, and this event has only been going for a short time. So, and then, of course, this little set's not so bad either. You know, either one of those sets is pretty nice. You know, full set, right across the board, all those wonderful little bonuses. Not bad at all. What are they got? And then down here, they got this guy. I don't know who this guy is. Um, this one will cost 40 and uh, he looks okay. He's a ranger. He's, you know, he's darkness. So, I mean, he's got some good skills. This is actually him up to 100. I guess it would be kind of hard to rank him up further because he's probably really hard to get. All right, let's take a step back. And then there's this. What is this? Oh, that's an item, which looks pretty cool, frankly. This is an artifact. Pretty cool one. Pretty, pretty legendary, I would guess. I'm guessing that color is legendary. But... Uh, yeah, I mean, this looks like it's going to work out pretty good. I mean, we got we got days left of this. So I am basically, for these events, I'm going to sit on um, as many as I can get. You know, I can sit on as many as I can possibly get and hopefully get as good rewards as I can. Um, I mean, even just that, right now I can get five more Prophecy Orbs. That sounds pretty good. That actually hell goes back to this event now and... They're probably going to get about 10, but I mean, that would get me to 15 down here so I can get more of them, right? And then if I just get to 100, I could get 10, and that pushes me, you know, you know what I'm saying here. You got a little chain here. So I'm going to be trying to save up as much as I can. The only thing about it is there's no reason for me to save the Prophecy Orb, so I'm going to use them. I have to use them anyway, right? So at very least, you know, going to get... Um, that stuff we got at the top there. So, you know, you get some pieces for a light and a darkness one. So, those are good. I mean, I might be able to rank one of them up one day. So, that's not so bad. So, this event, this event's going to be pretty good. And as I said, I got some, got some of them orbs. So, let me think. I think I've seen enough of them for now. I mean, I would love to get another one of her. But what are the chances of that happening? So, I'd kind of like to try to target somebody else. If I had to target somebody... I wouldn't mind targeting the dwarf, right? For an, I mean, they got some other guys in there that aren't so bad, too. I mean, if I got another Lord Balrog, maybe I'll rank him up. But, I mean, I do have the unique five-star from him. So, I mean, I don't really think I'm going to get five stars. But if you're going to shoot, shoot for something good, right? All right, so I'm going to just do this. Okay, well, let's... Uh, that, I think I might have pieces if I'm ready. So, I mean, when I look at something like that, I'm looking, can I rank him up? I don't know. We'll see. All right, let's just try another one and see how this works out. Okay, that's a different one. Okay, the good thing about this is that it's pieces, and they're not clogging up my inventory. You know what? My uh, hero one. There are, there are these guys are all sitting in here. So, can I filter? No, they don't let me filter here. I guess because it's not really creatures, it's pieces. So, they don't really let you do that. So I don't think I have any more of either one of those guys. No, okay. So let me just uh, look in here. Oh, I have two. Oh, I know that they're, they're similar looking, but no, that's not it. So I, I really don't have any of those, do I? I mean, I don't. I, other than um, her, Norma here, a four-star one. I don't have any four-star of those guys around at all. So. Ugh. Maybe I should be in a different, trying on a different area, right? Okay, so now we ran into problems in the old tower the last time. I'm hoping that my new healer lady is going to help. Now, how good is she? I saved something here. I'm going to take a little step over to the guild. Uh, by the way, I don't know if anybody has uh, done this. We got it into uh, level 9. They actually have this thing over here. Uh, little orders that pop up and then you can just hit the button and then basically you're just going to get these you're going to get money and you're going to get these little cards and stuff like that uh, of course you do have to i think you have to pump money into it and myself and another member have been kind of doing that it's just that i'm so broke right now from the last episode i didn't realize how much money i spent so even if i did get a six star the pieces for one i couldn't put them together because i don't have the money but we have been working on this fellow and i think i have the lead here so, this is the team that I've been using. Now, normally, the, the guys we're fighting right now are 100. So, they've been killing off my guys over time. I usually have, like, two or three guys standing at the end. Not anymore. Yeah. 
Yeah, the reason... The reason for that is that she is actually a really good healer. Notice they all have the, uh... The little heal over time now. So whether she's doing anything, they just kind of keep healing. So basically, these guys mostly end the... the uh, when, when this is over, it only goes 15 rounds. They only let you go 15 rounds. Um, at that point, they're usually all at full health. So, I mean, if they let us go until they were dead, it might take an hour, but they'd kill everybody. Basically because they're not dying. She just keeps... She does that, and they just keep healing like that over time. So I'm really hoping that's going to help in the tower. I mean, obviously the battle is going to be a lot quicker, and what we're fighting there does more damage. I'm just hoping to keep guys alive long enough to do the damage. Now, the thing is... Um... In the course of a fight like this, I'm actually kind of surprised it's the little assassin guy who usually ended up getting the most damage in. Basically because you have a limited number of targets, and um, once he applies his bleeding and then goes back, he does more damage. Now, although I think Dragon Slayer... Yeah, Dragon Slayer kind of jumped to the lead now. But if you look at it, he's in number two, even ahead of the dragon. Now, if you look at heal... Just look at how much healing she does over the course of a battle. I mean, it's way out in outer space because she's healing everybody and it just keeps rolling. Even when she was stunned, it just kept rolling and rolling. So, I'm hoping that that is going to help. I'll go back and do the other one a little bit later. So, let's step out and hopefully... Hopefully she's going to make the difference here. So, let's go over to the tower because we got stuck here. And, of course, this is another uh, mini-boss situation, I believe, right? Because I want that ring. Very close to be able to make a set of those. Probably give it to Dragon Slayer. Probably give it to Dragon Slayer. All right, let's go. Because this is going to be kind of ugly, probably. Oh, no, I didn't change... Oh, I didn't change it. We're going to lose. I didn't, I didn't put her in. I didn't put her in. So we're going to lose this. Are we? Oh, so close. I mean, it would have just made the difference there, you know? All right. We, we, we've seen that. We've seen that. Yeah, he does the most damage in the mage. Yeah, no surprises there. No surprises there. All right. Let's try that again. Only let me just do this right. Ugh. Okay. Them. You're out. You're in. All right. Hopefully this makes a difference. Okay. Does she get the big one down? Come on. Okay, they, they've got the healing over times in there now. See, they're still getting the heals. Yep, that made the difference, didn't it? How many times did you see me do that the last time? Was it three or four? Yeah, but you see the heals just kept landing on them, even though she was long gone. All right, so that's good. Let's, uh, let's move on. Okay, uh, ouch, ouch, and ouch. At least it's not all mages. That's really annoying. All mages are all priests. That's, that's kind of annoying. All right, let's go. All right, uh, I wish I had looked at the damage. Yeah, but you know, it's coming in that way each time now, you know? Um, and if you look at it, she actually did more damage than Aiden. Yeah, she did more damage than Aiden. She did more damage than the uh, assassin, too. So, I mean, she does do damage. She does do damage. And, of course, she heals, too, doesn't she? Yes, she does. All right, so... Let's keep going. I'm sure... Encounter number 200 is going to be really easy. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure it is. All right, so let's move on until we get stuck again. Okay, and there goes the healings. Okay, a couple are dead. 
Okay, could you wake up, please? You're my major damage dealer. Yep, and the healing just kept going on. Alright, uh, 198. Alright, let's do it. Keep going until we can't. Yeah, I mean, one of those really nice suits from the event on him in the front would just be really nice. I mean, he's already doing the most damage, and he's the primary tank. And he, oh, come on. Oh, okay, well, he's dead now, but the other stayed alive. All right. Okay, 199. Okay, Rangers, I believe? I think there are, I think those are Rangers. All right. All right, let's go. Wow, those were like all crits, weren't they? They, they just took the dwarf out. I guess they didn't... So, you know what? We're not going to hit you. We're just going to go for the dwarf. Okay. He took one for the team. All right, so, number 200. Anything good there? Okay, if that is the last part of that set. That's, that's the last part of that set. If I do get that, I'm going to throw it on him. I'll give his stuff to somebody else. But, uh, all right, let's uh, see if we can do this. Okay, so it's two tanks up front who do area attack, and then a bunch of rangers. Should be fun. He said sarcastically. Okay, healing, please. Oh, that's really bad. Okay. But it's looking good at the moment. Yes! Okay. All right. I'm um, not going to go any further. I think we've done enough for that today. But we're rolling along there. That one encounter, sometimes... You just run into a combination that's really bad. All those healers were really, really something. And I don't want to waste any time here. Where is he? Okay, so what he's what has he got right now? He's got health. He's got 156,000. And he's got uh, 6,200. Well, 6,300 on damage. All right, so I, got, I finally got a full set of this stuff. So I'm just going to say one key. Boom. All right, he's got my best stuff right now. So that goes to, or he's got 160,000 health now. And did his armor jump? You know, I wasn't paying attention to his armor, but I don't remember it being that high. Maybe it was. Anyway, he is doing, he's doing nearly 200 more on the damage. And he's got about five, nearly 5,000 more on the health. So, all right. I mean, I'd love to have that other set. But, you know, this is better. He, he has to have the good stuff here. All right, so I'll figure out who's going to get that other bunch of stuff. I think the other... Hold on a second. Where's the the mage? Where's he got? Oh, he's got a suit of that already. Okay, he had a suit of that already. Where is um, her? Considering how much her stuff is for damage, I think that's a good idea. You know, her... her uh, uh, healing is based on her damage. So I think that's probably a good idea to leave, to give to her the next best stuff. All right, so let's, uh, we probably can go in here now again. I think eight minutes has passed. So, you got any more jack-o'-lanterns for me? No. Oh, I wanted to do something else, didn't I? You know what, I'm going to do that first. What I wanted to do was, we got a bunch of these. So I think we can get some good artifacts here. Basically, these are the way. The, it seems to me these are the upgrades to the one you get previously. You know, the, I think we. I forget the color of the original ones, and then you get the ones that were gold, but now you get pieces of them, right? So they're like the better ones. So that's kind of what the other ones look like once you upgrade them. You know, let's grab another one. Let's just because I mean, there's no purpose in keeping these guys around unless you actually use them. What is that for? Okay, that's against warriors. And that one, 
is against Rangers. So, bag. Where are they? Are they here? No, they're here. I'm trying to find where they. Oh, there they are. They're down there. Right. These guys here are the ones that we had before. Mind you, that's like fully upgraded. If you look at this one, th yeah, a three star version, right? That's a three star version of what we had. And if you look at the new ones we just got, it's about the same for a, a, a one star version. So if I was to say, oh, I can't do that here. I th you have to go to a character, don't you? Um, what do I have on you? Oh, I already gave you one. I gave him the first one that I had because he gave him more damage. I'd like to go with the weaknesses here. He is... Oh, I gave him that one, right. I should probably give that one to the um, the healer, right? Um, I, it's another one. I just gave her the best one I could get. I'd rather keep it in sync. Where is Aiden? Aiden, I gave him a warrior one. So if I replaced... Did I get a warrior one? No, not that one. No. That one. Okay, so you see it's exactly the same. The other one's just... Alright, so what I'm going to do is... Let's... Replace. Upgrade. Upgrade. So how much is it going to cost to upgrade these guys? I got a ton of these. Alright, so add 10. That's not so bad. All right. How much is that going to get me? Whoa, that's that's not bad. All right, why don't we just throw in at one, at one, at one, at one, at one. Okay, there we go. And then upgrade that. And the next one would be a lot. All right, so we'll just leave that with him for now. I'll figure out who I'm going to give upgrades to. I need to get all of them first. All right, so let's go back in here now again. And the wizard stuff. Okay, just a little bit of that. Not enough to upgrade him. Not enough to upgrade him. All right, last fight. Let's see what they're going to throw at us. Wow. Ouch. That was kind of ugly. All right. And damage. She did more damage than Aiden again. The assassin did more damage. I mean, that's the reason I had no problem taking the Lady Mage out, is because she's a great healer, see, and um, she does seem to do more damage. So, anyway, I protected her so badly, and it seems that I didn't have to. Okay, so our new acquisition has definitely helped us, and uh, gonna keep her in there, obviously, yes. She uh, does seem to have replaced the Lady Mage. Because, well, you know, she does seem to do more damage and, of course, massive healing. So, I think we got us a group forming here. I, I don't know. I, I'm going to save up the Prophecy Orbs. Should I be trying just to do the Nature one and maybe luck into another version of her? What does she require for the other one? That's her. Yeah, I don't have that, that five-star right there. I don't have that five-star the one that's required. I should probably, you know, I should, I got a whole bunch of those, um, where are they? I got a whole bunch of these generic ones and I can have 24 stars. Maybe I should be doing that to see if I can actually put a bunch of, um, you know, what's names together, a bunch of five stars together just to have them. So that way I can figure out what Three stars I actually need to keep, right? We'll see. Uh, I do have space in the inventory now since we did a lot of stuff last week. It's just that uh, money, I need money. Okay, so anyway, I think that's going to do for now. So thank you very much for your attention. I really appreciate it. And play games because games are fun. See ya.